I got through the fence. Hope's not at the school, and... And obviously, I missed something big while I was gone. Just a magic mirror call with Professor Vardamus, who told us what I was afraid of. Doc's in a coma. Our blood I can't wake Dr. Saltzman up. It turns out the human brain doesn't heal so easy. It's the same way with certain diseases. The doctors finally came by, too. And they said that we won't know what we're dealing with until Dad wakes up. If. Perhaps there is a way to wake Dr. Saltzman and learn what happened to him. How? Another vampire power. The same one you used to reach me when I was trapped in Malifaux's mind. A head dive. She's right, if I can get you two in there and you find Doc, then... Then we might be able to bring him back with us. It's a good plan. But for all we know, a monster could have attacked Dad. So sorry, Caleb, but I'm not willing to trust someone who sold us out to Malivore. Guess that means it's up to you. I deserved every bit of that. I just wish there was something I could do. Perhaps there is. <laughs> because if Elizabeth is right and there's another monster out there, Dr. Saltzman isn't the only person you wronged who might be in danger. Or need help after what happened to Landon. I'm gonna find help. <laughs>